All right, guys, Hayes Inc. here. Welcome back to the channel. So we're going to be going in here and doing the second part of this. Um, not this. Where is it? Is it this one? There we go. Second part of this adventure thing. One adventure. <laughs> to be honest, there isn't any puzzles. It's beat the stages. The only thing I'll say is, um, now, I didn't do this because I am... Um, I don't know, I just, I just done it as is, but there's a shopkeeper, and um, supposedly if you don't speak to the shopkeeper, you're offered a different boost. It's like double hits or something like that. Um, I don't do that in this video, but when we see the option, I'll see if I can like actually see it on screen. I would obviously tell you guys, don't do that, do something else first so let's see if we can see this shopkeeper I actually might either be Zangief or Dowsim hmm got to do all the houses I don't even know what that said there see I hit that pretty quickly was that a shopkeeper I don't know. Let's check. Let's check. Say let's check, but realistically it's when the next bit of text comes up on screen. Let's see if 7am hazing never clicked it away. Because sometimes when I'm just trying to record footage in the morning, I'm like, uh Click, click, click. If you guys don't know, some of you might not know. You see that little boost tab down at the bottom? Where it says boosts. Right, that's the inn. That's not a shopkeeper. That's a shopkeeper. Wait. But how would you get up there then? I'm wondering how you would get up there if you don't speak to that person. Hmm. That's weird. Unless Sakura opened it for you. Because in a minute you'll go and talk to Sakura. And then... Um, maybe she opened the path up for you? Try and do everything else before you do that, that's all I'm saying, right? Before you actually do that, do everything else because supposedly you miss out on a boost if you do that. Now I went, I thought this here was a puzzle because usually this is a puzzle and maybe later this will turn into a puzzle because this is always a puzzle. But for some reason right now it's not a puzzle, so... Yeah, I do go back to that like once or twice because I thought, well, maybe this is how you open up the ice or whatever, but it wasn't. Um, still don't see a shopkeeper unless that, that must have been the shopkeeper. That is possibly the, the thing that stops you getting this boost, whatever it is. With that scroll up there, you give that to Sakura. And I'm wondering, Sakura does give you something and then nothing happens. So I'm wondering if you do that first, if that's how you get this boost. Hmm. Well, when you talk to Zangief, you'll notice that path opens up. I think the safest thing to do is just do that first. That's probably the safest thing to do. Then go and talk to that first house that we're going to go to in a minute after this. 
then do that if there is some kind of magical boost which I heard st or read Stu talking about on the discord so I doubt very much that it doesn't exist so if you talk here maybe if you do it in that order that's how you you get this um, boost that he's talking about see boost his lava as it's fuel you can stay like you see he cut her off there yeah, I went back up here, right, the reason I went back up here, just to be clear, is because it mentioned something about lava, I thought, did I fill this lamp up? I mean, that's logical, right? But no, you don't do anything, so this must come into play later, there's no way. I even went looking for the actual thing that she gave us, because I was like, why are you telling me about lava in this lamp, and then I don't do anything with it? <coughs> now... The one thing that most people are going to be asking themselves is how do you open the gate? Now I think it's quite obvious how you open the gate. I did go to look to make sure, but you can't open the gate, right? You cannot open the gate. So if you've come to watch this video to try and find out how do I open the gate, you can't. You're going to, need to wait three days, then you can open the gate. Because it says, when you go to speak to the boss, it says you have to beat the Shadlow boss in the red portal. The red portal doesn't open for three days. So that means you cannot open the gate. Once you've done that, you've got to come back to this stage. Then, when you come back to this stage, you can then open the gate. See, we'll see it here. So, go there. I need to go back to speak to the village chief. We'll do that just now. And the village chief will clarify. You need to open the red gate. Red portal, go there, go to the fiend cave, defeat the shadow boss, and then come back to here. So, if you've come here looking to know how to open that gate, you can't. That's it. I should answer. You cannot open that gate just yet. It's going to be three and a bit days. Basically four days, because you've got to do, like, today then wait look just to clarify use the red portal and the starting area to go to the fiend cave and defeat the shadow boss once you've done that you can then come back here and get your last chest now guys on the first portal some of you might not have known this because i didn't until someone in the comments told me when you finished it you've got to go to the very first house the one that gail was in and speak to gail and he's got a reward for you. So you might have missed out on that. So go back into that portal and make sure you've spoke to Gail. But anyway, that's it. We've just got to wait now. I've been Hazink. Thanks for watching. Catch you in the next one. Peace.